is this true? You, when you were younger, you went to see a palm reader. I did, yeah. Who yeah. told you something quite... I mean, I'm not into that sort of thing, actually, in general, you know. Yeah. But, but when I was sort of in my 20s, I think your 20s is a very difficult time for people. Mm -hmm. You know, it's when you're no longer a, a sort of hopeful young teenager and suddenly reality, you know, kicks in. You realise I have to pay the bills yeah. and the car insurance and boring stuff like that. And I was very insecure I'd, and I, I was very ambitious and I wanted to be an actress, I wanted to be a great actress and I never knew if it was going to happen. So I was kind of, you know, insecure. So I went to a, a psychic and um, he said, he gave me a big sheaf of papers mm. and he said, write it what I say down because I'll speak very quickly and you won't remember. So he gave me a pencil and this big sheaf of paper and he looked at my palm and then he started talking and he, and he did talk really, really fast. Mm. I was like, write, 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 write. And then at the end of it, I gave him a fiver and that was it. And I went out with my future in my hands. Like this, this big sheaf of papers. And I didn't remember anything that I'd written. But I looked at it and I thought, you know what? I don't want to know what my future is. Mm. I want it to be an adventure. So I literally went to the first rubbish bin I could find and I threw it, I threw my future away. <laughs> it's like, right. I don't want to know. I just want to, I want to carry on through life and, and it for it to be a surprise. But one thing he said that I remember, it's the only thing I remembered, which was he said, you won't be, you will be very successful, but you won't really become, a, a, you know, really successful until you're, until you're past 40. And, of course, when you're 22, you don't want to hear that, do you? No. I, I, I can't wait that long. You know, so... Um, and he was right. He was absolutely right about that. It's amazing. That's incredible. I'm well into it. I've had my palm done a lot and it's always been uh, quite... Was it, yeah. does it, did it tell you that you're coming here? He said I would sit here and that you would <laughs> tell a story yeah, yeah, yeah. about <laughs> yeah. having your palm... Yeah. No. What about you, JK? <laughs> do, you, do you visit psychics? Is that something you'd ever do? I have not done that, but I, I, I don't discount that. I, I'm, I'm wondering if you've been back to that guy and given him a really big tip. <laughs> yeah, I should do. I mean, I more than a funny. fiver. He wasn't, you know, he wasn't one of these guys with neon signs outside. He was just in an ordinary little living room, an Indian guy, interestingly. Um, but, no, I've, I've never forgotten that. It's very, very interesting. Well, we tracked him down, and he's here <laughs> tonight. <laughs>